airs a couple boards their dog overnight and the unthinkable happens. Their eight pound Pomeranian is mauled to death by another dog. Now tonight the owners are speaking out as there's talk of a lawsuit and counter charges of blackmail. Alex Michelson has exclusive details in this San Diego 6 investigation. Alex. Jim and Heather, when that couple came here to Camp Diggity Dogs in Sherman Heights and rang this doorbell, little did they know it would be the last time they'd see their dog alive. Hate leaving your dog home alone? Don't like to kennel your dog? From the TV commercial, Camp Diggity Dog looks like a perfect overnight spot for your pooch. Mom, Kelly loves Camp Diggity Dog. Fiancés Ryan Messenger and Laura Hiltz brought in their five-year-old Pomeranian, Bailey. A day later, the owner called them crying. Bailey was dead. I was just shocked. I couldn't even believe it. I was like, what? And he's like, Bailey's dead. I lost my balance. I just felt so sick. I just fell. <laughs> Bailey is and was and will always be my complete world. The necropsy shows Bailey was covered in blood, sustained multiple puncture wounds, and died from dog bites. Laura says Bailey was supposed to be separated from bigger dogs and wasn't. Now she's suing for an undisclosed amount. The reason is their negligence. They left dogs that were at least three or four times the size. This is the small dog pen where Bailey died inside Camp Diggity Dog. Animal Control says besides this incident, they've never had a complaint about this location. Animal Control and the San Diego Humane Society have both visited and agreed it was no one's fault. A spokesman says it was too dark for webcams to pick up exactly what happened that night. But he suggested Ryan's English Bulldog may have killed his companion. Unfortunately, the dog that died never made enough noise to be heard. Camp Diggity Dog also claims that Laura and Ryan's camp tried blackmail. The owners have threatened to go public unless we give them $20,000. But Bailey's owners claim the opposite is true. I was specifically asked not to go to the media. In an email sent to Ryan, Camp Diggity Dog says someone will now always be outside the dog pen 24-7 what they're calling Bailey's rule. There's no rule that could bring him back. Alex Michelson, San Diego 6 News.